What is up, people? This is your boy Jay, and I'm presenting to you another unboxing video. We got another package in the mail, and we're gonna open this up and see what it is. Pretty large package, yeah. Big package. So I'm gonna try and open this and see what inside this box you know I just take this and just cut it down the side hmm. trying to do this with one hand Trying to cut this open with one hand. All right, let's see what we got in this box here. It's an extremely large box here, guys. I want to know what's inside of it. Whew. Yeah, these unboxing things could be something when you're just here doing it by yourself. Instead of having someone to film it while you do the unboxing. So I want to see what's inside this box. Okay. Guys. Okay. Let's see what we got in here. See what it is on this side here. Ah, I think I see what it is. And, ladies and gentlemen, it is my headlights that I ordered. <sighs> these. Now I had these lights before when I got them from the junkyard for my 09. And I'm reordering them again for the 2011. I'm putting these on the 2011 Crown Vic. Now, I'm going to do something different with these, though. With these here. All right, let's open it back up. There you go, guys. Wow. They look even better when they're brand new. <laughs> so, but I'm going to be doing something different with these here. Something that I have never seen anybody do. So I may be the first to do this, and it may be a trend for those who order these headlights. I paid 200 and something for them on eBay, brand spanking new. And they got here very quick. Very quick they got here. I'm impressed. They got here really quick, guys. So that looks good. This one is would be the passenger side. But yeah, I'm gonna try something different with these that I have not seen anybody do with these particular uh, lights here. I'm gonna change a couple of things in them and I'm gonna see if anybody would recognize what I've done to them when I put them on the car because these are going on the 2011 Crown Vic right along with some other things but we're going to change something here and I'm not going to say anything about it but I'm going to do it and then you'll see the difference when I put it on the car so and then you'll I will you'll be able to judge the difference then but this is but yeah I'm going to be putting these here on the 2011 Crown Vic so I'm going to be taking my clear, uh, yeah, I got a little, look like a scratch now from the side. That's where this stuff is. That could be right, though. Okay, but yeah, I'm going to be using these here for the crown date, but yeah. All right, guys, let's see what we got here. Let's go around them. See, and then unlike my other ones, one of these was missing and all that kind of stuff, so I had some 
hard, kind of difficult time putting these in. But yeah, but anyway, I got them brand spanking new this time. And like I said, I'm going to change a couple of things in these. And I want to know if anybody's going to recognize the change I make to these. So y'all stay tuned for when I get ready to install these on the Crown Vic. You will see the difference. First, I'm going to do a video with the installation. And then I'll do a second video showing what I did differently to these. And like I said, it's going to be a real small change. But it's going to be something that, you know, that will bring some ideas to these lights here. So, this is your boy Jay signing off saying peace, be safe, be blessed. And I will catch you guys on the next video. I'm out.